Welcome to Pro Upcast News, where we bring you daily industry updates. Today is Wednesday, June 9th, and you're watching the Afternoon Update with Sarah Fletcher. Today's news is sponsored by Game Plan Financial. Every game has a winner. Every winner has a game plan. For more information, visit www.gameplanfinancial.com. Now for today's headlines. Speaking before the House Budget Committee this morning, Federal Reserve Chairman Ben Bernanke said that debt in Europe should not affect the U.S. economy. However, the chairman cautioned legislators to make plans for our own economy as soon as possible amid continued pressure on state and local budgets. According to Bernanke, quote, to avoid sharp disruptive shifts in spending programs and tax policies in the future and to retain the confidence of the public and the markets, we should be planning now how we will meet these looming budgetary challenges, unquote. In economic news, the price per barrel for oil this morning climbed nearly $2 or 3% to a figure of $73.96 on the New York Mercantile Exchange. This action on the exchange came after the American Petroleum Institute reported a larger than expected decrease in oil stockpiles. Meanwhile, AAA reports that the national average for a gallon of regular unleaded fuel fell to $2.713 from the previous day's price of $2.718. In property casualty news, the number of Americans applying for homes declined for the fifth consecutive week, having dropped to an alarming 13-year low. In fact, demand for loans dipped 5.7 percent in the week ended June 4th, having reached the lowest level since February of 1997, the Mortgage Bankers Association reports. Finally, analysts say that this trend could likely be the result of many Americans having signed purchase contracts ahead of the April 30th deadline for up to $8,000 in federal tax credits. I'm Sarah Fletcher, and thanks for watching ProUpcast News. For more in-depth news and features, visit ProducersWeb.com.